Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be sharing my results and where I have, uh, where I'm at so far from the first. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Jessica Wolf. I have been on keto for 10 years and this year, as of July 1st, I decided I'm going to go carnivore. Well, I've been keto, switched to keto ketovore, more meat-based, and now I've decided I'm going to try carnivore because I've been struggling with energy and weight and just a number of different things that I decided I'm going to do this. I'm um, So for the month of July, I'm going carnivore to see how things are going. So after I've done my three-day sardine fast, getting kick-started, I did, have been doing great. I've had my ketones were on point. Now, this morning is the first time that I did not have my, um, that I wasn't in ketosis at zero. Otherwise, I've been in nutritional ketosis, which is amazing for me because usually if I eat, all of a sudden I'm not out of ketosis. Even a three-day water fast, I would, um, it would take me 70 hours before I would end up getting into any level of ketosis. Everything read zero. So I've been amazed that I've been able to stay in ketosis and be able to eat for over a week now. And so I'm going to share my results of how things have been going. When I have more energy, I, uh, a few things that I wasn't expecting to do. One of the things I was planning on doing was giving up all sweeteners, the sweeteners that are in um, spices and seasonings, and there's quite a few of them. I cleaned out my cupboards. One of the, the only thing I was allowing myself were gonna be the flavored element packets, which I absolutely love. However, I've been without them for the last couple days and have been doing even better. So I've eliminated even these packets as flavored water. I've been drinking plain, plain water, but carbonated. Because I, I don't, I don't like plain water. But if I carbonate it, I'm, I'm good. So that's what I've been doing. I've also been cutting back on my coffee to the point I put my coffee pot downstairs in the basement. And if I put it downstairs in the basement, when I get up in the morning, I don't want it that badly to go down and get it or to brew a pot of coffee. So that has helped me as well. I, I thought I was using coffee to help prolong the hunger and really it was making me more hungry as I'm going through this. I'm finding so much more out. So those are two things I wasn't ex really expecting to give up that I'm planning on just continuing with this giving up. All right. So I have been using the My360 app in order to record my, um, my measurements. So it makes things so much easier. All right. So for weight loss since the first, I am down six pounds, which is great. Um, my body fat is three tenths of a percent lower. This is a short period of time. I wasn't planning on, um, I was actually, after my sardine fast, I was expecting to gain some of that weight back and I haven't, so I'm happy. Uh, I, in the app, it gives you your body surface area and that has been down one tenth of a square foot. <laughs> but my lean body mass has increased a tenth and that's exactly what I want. I want to know that I am burning fat and building muscle which knowing that my ketones have been in that nutritional state have been great indicator of that. And then today I am starting the PSMF. Uh, so that's protein sparing modified fast. And I'm going to be doing that for 10 days. So it's high protein, um, moderate, I'd say low fat and um, lowering calories. And I have that all planned out, how I'm going to do that. But that was, that's my results for the week. And I am feeling great. I have more energy than I did before. I am using my StepBet app 
to um, keep me motivated to get my steps in and I actually haven't had to check on where I am um, throughout the, the day like it used to to make sure I had my steps in. I'm easily getting my steps in in the afternoon before evening and I've had uh, several days where I have more steps in this week than I probably have in the last six weeks without even trying. Now that says something. Uh, if, if nothing else, I mean, I am, it, it's getting me up and moving because I have so much more energy. So I just wanted to share that with you uh, on that step bet as well. So if you've enjoyed this video and you want to learn more about keto, ketobore, carnivore, make sure you hit the subscribe button, like this video, and turn on that little bell notification so then you'll be alerted anytime I'm doing these updates and sharing my experience, not only with the carnivore, but also my daughters are more keto, ketobore, and so I will be sharing tips on that as well. And if you know anyone that might be interested in the keto or carnivore, please share this video with your friends, family. If you have anyone uh, suffering from any type of disease or any type of inflammation, this is really what this is about is eliminating inflammation. So go ahead, share this video. And if you have any questions, make sure you comment below and let me know, are you going to be joining me on this journey?